They are part of a national identity. I was reading the other day that there's 30 million basketball fans, uh, Fenerbahce fans around this whole country, which is amazing. You know, speaking of what, 70, 80 million people and you got 30 million, you know, Fenerbahce fans. Fenerbahce is a big club, I don't know how many millions of fans, but we have over here people that they are always with us, they support us and their support is amazing. Basketball right now, I believe, is the sport number one in Turkey. Fenerbahce, Beko, Istanbul have established themselves as one of the EuroLeague's giants. Having made five straight final fours, for the 2017 champions, expectations are always sky high. But after losing seven of their first nine games this season, the Turkish Super Club found themselves in an unfamiliar position. Fenerbahce, Beko, Istanbul stunned into silence. For Fener, their road woes continue. And Barcelona are destroying Fenerbahce here. Zelko Bradovic looking like the volcano is getting ready to explode. This is not excuse and can be because last year we play also a lot of games outside. We need to play like team and to, 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 to trust ourselves that we have enough quality to, to play good basketball. Man, I, I feel like we can achieve a lot. You know, we just got to get a streak going, play with energy, passion. You know, our fans are going to be there um, at all the games, so that's the least that we can do. And in round 10, everything changed. Fenner sent a message to the EuroLeague. Dead and buried, some said. Not a bit of it. A season resuscitating Fenerbahce win in front of their passionate following. The game against us was very important because we had to cheer up ourselves, you know, to this game the best way we can do it. And, you know, in that game, like, we won it. So now we have, you know, a little bit more confidence, but we have, we need to stay locked in, you know, because now is the time. You can't win a championship in one game, but you can keep building off of that. And, you know, these fans are going to be behind us the entire, the entire time. You can't say anything bad about that, man, when you have 15, 16,000 people in the arena every single night. But, man, we have a lot to prove. And I think that with our start, to, this, to the year in the EuroLeague. It's just gonna give us that much more motivation to really finish this thing out and uh, compete for a championship. That's still the goal regardless of how we started. And um, with the players that we have, I don't see why that can't happen.